Disney's Wish failed to take off at the box office last weekend, adding a dismal theatrical opening to the film's already poor reviews, making it Disney's latest in a series of financial disappointments as the company struggles to bring audiences back to theaters. Wish opened in theaters just two weeks after The Marvels, another major flop for Disney this year. The Marvels opened with a disappointing $46.1 million in its opening weekend, the worst domestic opening weekend performance for any Marvel Cinematic Universe film and less than a third of the opening weekend of 2019's Captain Marvel, the film's predecessor. Some industry experts attributed the film's underperformance to superhero fatigue. The Marvels has grossed $188 million worldwide to date, far behind Captain Marvel, which topped $1.1 billion, and many other Marvel films, which had historically been reliable hits. In another box office bomb this year, Disney's Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny debuted with just $60 million in its opening weekend and grossed $383 million worldwide, a major disappointment considering its nearly $300 million budget. Dial of Destiny is the worst performing Indiana Jones film at the domestic box office, without adjusting for inflation, despite being released more than 40 years after the original film. Haunted Mansion was another bomb this year, making just $24 million in its domestic opening weekend and $117 million in total worldwide against a $150 million budget. Haunted Mansion may have failed to attract audiences because of its July release, Variety reported. The then ongoing actors' strike prevented its stars from promoting it, and some industry experts felt the film would have better suited the Halloween season. The Little Mermaid and Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, other Disney films released this year, were considered disappointments for falling below industry projections despite grossing more than double their budgets. Wish, an animated musical starring Ariana Debus and Chris Pine, failed to outgross The Hunger Games, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, which surpassed expectations to win its second straight weekend at the box office, and Ridley Scott's historical epic, Napoleon, which also beat expectations to place second. The Hunger Games grossed $42 million at the domestic box office over the five-day Thanksgiving weekend, while Napoleon grossed $32.5 million, just $800,000 more than Wish. The Thanksgiving box office totaled about $172 million, the best outing since the pandemic, but theaters still haven't recovered to pre-pandemic levels when Thanksgiving weekend regularly surpassed $250 million in total gross, CNBC reported. Wish has just a 50% rating on Rotten Tomatoes, making it one of the worst-reviewed Disney animated films of all time.